national cyber security exercise is playing a critical role in strengthening India's cyber defense. The platform brings together stakeholders from government and industry through brainstorming sessions, practical exposure and simulated scenarios. Bharat NCX is shaping the future of India's cyber strategy. TD India's correspondent Shubhendu Ghosh gets us more on this. The Bharat National Cyber Security Exercise is underway in New Delhi from 18th to 29th November with an aim to equip critical sector organizations with skills to tackle modern cyber threats. Wednesday witnessed two important launches, National Cyber Reference Framework and National Cyber Range 1.0. NCRF provides a structured approach to cybersecurity governance and NCR 1.0 is a cutting-edge facility for cybersecurity research training. To tell you very frankly, cybersecurity is something which cannot be seen in isolation. And the Honorable Prime Minister has mentioned previously, it is no longer cybersecurity, it is national security, it is not only restricted to cyber. Cyber is a part of each one of our day-to-day -day life be it an aspirant uh, who is uh, selling vegetables or be it somebody who is at the apex level or at the apex corporate level, cyber affects each one of us. And a loss or a cyber attack on anyone is felt as bad. So that is why it is very important for us to be firstly be cyber aware, ensure cyber hygiene and have a workforce which is totally cyber security trained. The hands-on training sessions at Bharat NCX 2024 provides participants with practical exposure through simulated scenarios, enabling them to enhance their proficiency in cyber incident response and resilience building techniques. The significance of the National Cyber Security Conclave is that it represents a quantum leap forward in terms of thought process, in terms of the commitment of the government towards more uh, inclusive approach and towards recognizing the fact that the private sector can play a very important role. That's the reason why today we are having the CISO conclave where we are having CISOs not just from various tech, tech sectors within the government but from the private sector. Today a critical information infrastructure, a big chunk of this is already in private hands. So this kind of a national conclave becomes a melting pot. Meanwhile, Bharat Cyber Security Startup Exhibition at the venue showcased innovative solutions from India's leading innovators. Bharat NCX 2024 is organized by National Security Council Secretariat in collaboration with Rashtriya Raksha University. India is ranked among top five countries most affected by cybercrime in the world. Initiatives like National Cyber Security Exercise aims to ensure that India's cyber defense remains robust and future ready. With camera person Anand Kashyap, Shubhendu Ghosh for DD India, New Delhi. All right, Bharat Cyber Security Startup Exhibition is focusing on areas like threat intelligence, operational tech security, and advanced analytics, highlighting India's entrepreneurial entrepreneurial potential in cyber security. Now the startups talk to DD India about cyber security issues and their domain expertise. So cyber security has become quite robust now, may it be for individuals, organizations, small, medium or large scale businesses. In this age of AI hacking and uh, cyber threat scenario, antiviruses and uh, threat protection systems are not enough. So people say that I have an antivirus, I have a firewall, I'm protected. Not exactly, because it's more robust and complicated. So cyber digital consultants, we have gone ahead and built a cyber security system, which is 100% made by India, made for analysts. So we've made it a complete comprehensive cyber defense platform. Cyber security, I would say, uh, the significance of cyber security in India is very huge. Why? Because the potential is huge and it's become the second largest data hall of India itself because next to China we are the largest. And data becoming more and more secure and more and more important for everyone in the industry. It has become very good. And as an organization, we as an Inspark, we are a part of Amrita University, which is basically a startup company under incubated under Amrita University itself. We've been here for the last five years and starting from Amrita itself, we are, we are managing the large installations of Government of India itself from a cyber security stand-up. So cyber security in current phase of India is growing because uh, 
bigger and bigger is getting bigger day by day. The requirement of cyber security tool, because as we are large in population and also the systems are getting online, huge amount of data is being collected. So our platform is completely integrated with us AI ML and it's for AI ML. And so we are increasing the efficiency by up to 60%. And also the SOC analyst, which which and do the analysis of the so all the SOC tools, their man hour is decreased by 90%. So like I said, 42 Labs is into uh, quantum safe, post quantum cryptography based cybersecurity solutions. We primarily take care of data, we take care of access, and we take care of digital operations, which is almost the entire gamut of uh, digital security. So it's a platform that helps you secure your data, users, and operations. So in the context of today's uh, exercise, Bharat NCX, cyber security has to be thought of in two prongs. The first approach would be uh, Atma Nirvarta, which is indigenous. The second is uh, every company has global aspirations. So from that perspective, what you build for today has to last longer.